Equine Assisted Services, EAS, are providing a unique therapeutic experience for a diverse group of people. Equine therapy is an experiential learning approach, originally proposed by David Kolb, with a mission to serve knowledge through transformational experiences. The umbrella term EAS covers three main categories, therapy, horsemanship, and learning. EAS often consists of hypotherapy or psychotherapy, which addresses mental health disorders, developmental disabilities, addiction, and more in an atypical counseling environment. So for equine therapy, that's involving either a mental or physical health professional. So it's very specific with treatment goals for the client, whether it's psychological, sociological, or physical health goals in there. So therapy is a very small part of it. So a lot of what we do might be called interventions or activities. Beyond a pet owner relationship, horses provide an experiential means and metaphorical learning through interactive guided sessions. Skills are practiced by groundwork or riding the horse. According to the Kimberly Cole PhD, the Ohio State University Equine Extension Specialist, hippotherapy involves equine movement, but there is no such thing as hippotherapists. They have to be either PT, physical therapist, OT, occupational therapist, or a speech and language pathologist to do hippotherapy. However, those certifications are not required to offer therapeutic riding services. In both situations, there is an emphasis on human-animal interaction. Horses are reactive to their environments. Cole describes them as quick to give feedback without ulterior motives. In Northeast Ohio, Hope Meadows does groundwork with a diverse range of participants. Equine services are beneficial to at-risk youth, veterans, first responders, and juveniles. As mental health awareness continues to rise, future developments of the EAS industries will create useful careers for equine and equine professionals. Benefits of equine therapy are hard to recreate and continue to grow in popularity.